Airport OOTD. This is the same outfit that I wore to Chiang Mai. So I think, I think it has a hint of Chiang Mai. 350 baht for a 30 minute ride, but you're, <laughs> I'm telling you, it's so, I don't know why. It's like 5 a.m. and it's super humid, or is it just the change from AC to humid weather? Look, like, like girl's glasses is fogged out. 5.30 a.m., why there's so many people out here? But look, I think that's so funny. JK! Technically my third time here. The second time was when I went to Phuket, but that was domestic travel with Air Asia. And now it's international travel with ANA. There's gonna be three stops, four boarding pass, rough life. Having Dairy Queen for breakfast. Squatting at an airport. Where I live, it's 16 degrees Fahrenheit, which is the type of, like Fahrenheit, and that's how it is. That's like the type of cold that hurt. I cannot believe I went from summer to winter in a day. The whole trip was actually in November 2022, and right now it's January 2023. So it's been more than a month that I'm home. For the past month, I've been trying to edit the vlogs, but it's actually really emotionally exhausting because I've been re-watching the footages and reliving the whole trip. I would watch day one with day 25 memory. Those vids that you see, it's not really me anymore. I mean, it's still me, but it's not me. I'll insert like a breakdown of how much I spent in Thailand in 25 days. I was gonna do like an in-depth video about how much I spent but that'll be kind of boring because then I'll just be talking about like what I spent on. So this is the updated me. This is January 2023 me. Next time I do anything like that, I will do better. I will do better for you. <laughs> but anyway, I'll see you guys in another video which will most likely be a reaction video because I have not done a reaction in a solid two months.